Today's lesson is about radioisotypes. There are many different kinds and each of them give out different emissions. But first you should know what a radioisotype actually is. Radioisotypes are unstable isotypes that decay or break up, giving off high energy radiations and forming different atoms. Each radioisotype has a different emission. Some of them have more than one. These emissions are gamma, beta, and alpha. Strontium-90 is an example of a radioactive isotype of strontium, produced by nuclear fission with a half-life of 28.8 years. Strontium-90 is used for medical applications. It is a radioactive source of some cancers. Some amounts of strontium-90 and strontium-89 can be used in the treatment of bone cancer. It is also a radioactive tracer, so when it is in a patient's body, you can trace it whether it is going to trouble the patient. The benefits of consuming strontium-90 are reduces osteoporosis, treats arthritis, prevents cavities, treats cancer in the bone, and reduces fracture risk. There are a few side effects and dangers of consuming strontium-90. With high doses, it might damage the bones, and some, aside, and some side effects can be stomach pain, diarrhea, and headaches. The side effects from this radioisotype are not life-threatening and dangerous. In large doses, is, but nobody takes that much medicine. Therefore, strontium-90 is not a problem in digesting. Thank you for watching my presentation and I hope you have learnt a lot about radioisotypes.